Hello and welcome back to the fourth section of this video course titled Developing a Windows Desktop Client Application. In this video titled Why I Use VCL Libraries, we will talk about the VCL framework. So let me say a few words about VCL. VCL is an acronym for the Visual Component Library. It represents a set of visual components for rapid development of Windows applications in the Delphi language. VCL contains a large variety of visual, non-visual and utility classes for various tasks. Components in general are a subset of the component library that descend from the class T component. You can place components on a form or a data module and manipulate them at design time. Visual components are called controls and descend from T control. Controls are used in GUI applications and appear to the user at runtime. T controls provide properties that specify the visual attributes of controls such as their height and width. Non visual components are used for a variety of tasks but they are not visible to the user at runtime. Other VCL classes are classes that are not components. Their descent from T object and they are also used for a variety of tasks, but you cannot create instances of these classes at the design time. The VCL was released with the first version of Delphi. It is mostly a thin wrapper over the Windows API controls, but also includes a lot of owner draw controls. It uses GDI, Windows handles, and Windows messages. VCL is today the best Windows desktop library. Now it is very mature framework with which we can create native optimized application very fast to load with multi-core CPU support, integration with all Windows API, not to mention a large number of excellent third-party VCL UI controls. Latest improvements of VCL are even better layout management, high DPI support, multi-monitor support, and many other features that are becoming increasingly important on today's desktop Windows computers. In summary, VCL is really amazing and continues to get fixes and new features. It is a better user interface framework than any other out there, so use VCL when you're only targeting Windows. Let me show you how you can work with VCL components. From main menu, select File, New, and then select VCL Forms Applications. Since we selected VCL Forms application, appropriate components will be shown in IDE of Delphi on Tool Palette. They are grouped and you have a search bar so they are easily accessible. You can drag and drop component on the form or select component by left click on it and then left click on the form where you want to put this component. You design the user interface of an application by arranging the visual components on a form. For instance, let us put a button on a form. In Tools Palette search box, start typing button and as soon T button appear, select it with a left click and then click somewhere on a form. We can set published properties at the design time by using the object inspector and in some cases property editors. The events page of the object inspector displays all events defined for given components. We can of course set published properties of components through code. 